Hey, in today's video, we're going to talk about how to level up quickly during the double XP score event going on right now. Not only that, we're going to talk about Bethesda's hints towards the new features coming our way, as well as a way to test this within the private test servers, and this is all coming to us shortly. Let's start this video off with a glitch that you guys are all familiar with, and I'll leave a suggestion box at the top. I honestly prefer this over the natural way of getting XP, which is heading over to West Tech and then using the elevator to respawn. On the enemies within there and sure that is a great way of doing this but if you're like me and you just want to stay in one spot and not have to do this whole like traveling between load screens and all that crap well then you ultimately might like this instead because you can stay in one spot you're just gonna have to deal with one scorch beast maybe two depending on if you break the spawn but right here you're gonna see me gain a ton of XP and this is all because I have a lunchbox enabled high stats on the intelligence, as well as a great amount of XP buffs that you can use with the jacuzzi on here. That is a recent new camp item that you can get at the atomic shop there. But uh, yeah, this is what I've been using to gain a lot of XP, and I'll show you this here shortly on how much I was able to level up. Now, as this is going on in the background, let's talk about the new PTS information that is supposed to head our way here shortly. And this is all coming to us in September. Yes, September is some uh, new features, so let's just dive into it right here. Head over to Bethesda.net. We can find this inside the vault. If we take a look at this first section of this page, the public test server reopens up is what it states at the top. Without reading this word by word, let me just explain what Bethesda said. Basically, they're excited that this has lasted a week. Uh, of course, they did not mention the bugs or the glitches within this. But they are ecstatic to reveal some new information and they're looking forward to releasing the next major Fallout 76 update and apparently this is targeted for September. And when in September? I'm going to guess anywhere between the Tuesdays, right? That's really when they you know, throw in those updates or even Wednesday could be a possibility. They mentioned within this that they haven't discussed what exactly is in store for the September update, but they did say that this will include a significant new future that will give us players a more variety on how we choose to experience the Fallout 76 world. So I, I don't know what that's supposed to mean, but it's supposed to be a positive thing I'm ex expecting. I don't know. But they're shooting to reopen the server within this month so that's sometime within this actual month that we're in right now so that's gonna be cool and i can't wait to get my hands on that next up treasure hunter returns and this will start from 12 p.m eastern time on july 15th to 12 p.m eastern time on july 19th and last but not least the double score is going to end shortly here soon on the 19th so make sure you take full advantage of what you're doing and try to double up on all that beautiful score and what i have to leave you with finally is this disarm glitch that all of you are familiar with. Um, if you're on PC, you're going to have a better effect with this, especially if you turn off your V-Sync, just an additional tip. And if you're like me and you hate climbing all the way up to the top, you can simply go to Daily Ops and then leave the server and then join back and you'll spawn right at the top again. All credit to a great content creator out there. He doesn't get much respect for all the great credit he does give uh, towards some channels, which... Uh, actually respect him on that and that is your friendly neighborhood gamer go check him out i'm not sure if he is still around here throwing some updates uh on what's working but he, he does a great job on that and giving up the credit so all kudos to him and uh this is what i just wanted to show you guys that these glitches are in fact working properly i did this today as we speak and man i am able to get a lot a lot of junk and xp from this now, if it does not work the second time or the third time, that's just based on either the V-Sync because, uh, if, of course, if you have it off, it will trigger a lot more and a lot faster. And what you'll notice, too, which is kind of odd, is it'll continuously trigger once you've stopped. Uh, so if you, you walk away, you'll just hear the constant triggering sound. Uh, without a doubt, guys, I hope that this video was helpful for you guys and you were able to you know stick through the whole thing. Thank you guys, have a great day, take care of yourselves, live well, and have a great one. See you guys on the next one. Peace.